What is a straw man argument? An ad hominem attack? Incorrect equivocation? <laughs> we'll find out how top proponents of evolution use incorrect facts and misleading logic to deceive. Right now on Wonders Without Number. Logic is the study of correct or incorrect reasoning. Now, logic is based on rules and science. Reasoning can involve our own personal opinions. That's oh, the difference between the two. Okay. But logic is based on good sound principles, good sound rules and regulations there. There's a difference. Hmm. Logic involves the use of arguments, such as a chain of statements, where we have one or more premises mm -hmm. that leads to a conclusion. Ad hominem. In Latin, it means to the man. In other words, they're taking the argument to the person, not against the information or the claim. Why should science journals give space to intelligent design or any other crackpot pseudo theory? Mm -hmm. Rather than trying to refute the scientific evidence, yep. they're just going to resort to name calling, equivocation. The science we use to put men on the moon is the same science we use to study evolution and the origin of species. <laughs> well, the science we use to put men on the moon is observational, repeatable science. Yes. What we study evolution is historical science, things we can't see. When somebody makes a statement, let's look at their premise, hmm. their starting point. Mm -hmm. That might be wrong. Therefore, the conclusion could be wrong. And we see that a lot in evolution. Yes, and, we sure do. And in the statements made by evolution. So why should we learn about logic again? A Christian worldview in our thinking? Well, 2 Timothy 2.15 says something. Be diligent or study to present yourself approved to God, a worker who does not need to be ashamed, rightly dividing the Word of God.